Hey everyone, it's Mr. Chapa Touch 31. How's it going? Um, in today's video, I have a review of uh, the Zugu Smart Case 2 for the Apple iPad. Um, they did send this out to me for a review, so uh, thank you to them. Link in the description if you want to buy this case. Um, uh, but um, this retails for fifty dollars plus shipping. It's about fifty-five. And um, yeah, it's a pretty cool case. It is the second one they have made. Uh, on their website, I do have a little tip for them if they um, are watching this video. Uh, they probably aren't, but um, I think that they should, in their products thing, they only have this case. Now, this is a great case, but some people may like the first version better. So, if you want to make your customers have more choices, um, make them have, like, their custom, their their choice that they want, basically. That's kind of what I just said. But um, if you want them to be more happier and have better reviews or something, uh, put your other case back up there. Um, they might, I mean, so some people might like that better. I mean, this one is supposedly to be perfect and they call it perfect and everything on the website no case is really perfect but uh this one is still a nice case so uh i have already opened it but i did put it back in the package here's the front of it obviously it's a zugu smart case up there spelled with a k for the case and it's fully adjustable you can use it as a headstand mount for your car so if you got some kids or something or maybe even if you just want to watch a movie strap it onto the car obviously you probably have to be in the back seat to watch it you can play a movie you can put it at any angle right there, so you can, uh, it, for, for typing it's best at this angle, for like viewing YouTube videos it's probably best at that one, or maybe even that one, maybe even that one, I don't know. On the side, we've on this, both, all three of the sides, we've just got this nice cool little green, white, um, pattern. On the back we've got their website, Zugu.com, we've got a couple more angles, we've got a barcode right here, and then we've got a, um, leather sample, which is the actual case right there. And uh, again, it's adjustable head mount and everything, and um, also has a one-year limited warranty on it. So uh, I'm because it's limited, I'm not sure what it is, but I'm guessing if like it rips or something, something bad goes wrong, uh, they'll send you out a new one. So let's go ahead and open it up. I have already opened this, and I have been using this case for quite a long time, but I tried to put it back as I remembered. And I didn't remember quite how they packed it, but I'll try to do my best. Um, in here they do a, um, which is nice about this company is uh, they have just gotten started, and the guy was actually, he got fired from his job and he started making these cases. And, um, well, what's nice about this is uh, they give $1, $1 from every case is donated to help children around the world. So it'll go to a children um, to help them get some food, some clean water, clothes. So, um, if you think about it, that's actually a lot. Let's say they sell 100 cases in a week. Um, they probably sell more than that. But that is $100 that's going towards the kids, which is great. I mean, they don't have to do that. That's a that's actually a lot of money when you think about it. On the back, they've got uh, just some free accessories. You just have to pay for shipping, so technically it's not free. And they've also got a YouTube channel if you want to go check that out. I'll probably have his link in the description if I can remember it. So just read the description if you want the links. So here we've got um, just what it can do. Right there. Uh, actually, this is just how it can, not not just what it can do, but how to put it into a headstand mount for the car. All you do is open the straps, and then you gotta flip the whole thing around. You gotta take this velcro off, and then you just strap it on. It's pretty self-explanatory, but it's nice that they can include that. And then obviously, kickstand directions. Most of this is self-explanatory, but if you are new and don't really get cases, I guess it's great for you. So here we've got the case itself. I'm not even sure if this is how it came packaged. But I hope I put it in the right way. Also, uh, right off on the front, we've got this nice lever. It's kind of hard, not too hard. We've got this Velcro. If you open it up, again, this nice soft thing that's not going to scratch your screen or anything. And then it comes with this styrofoam. I'm not sure if there's anything in here. Like I said, I said this a couple times now. I did open this a long time ago. And then um, right here, oh, they've got this flap. So when you put your iPad in, you close it. And it doesn't, uh, your iPad won't fall out if you go like that or something. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and just flip over to the back real quick. We've got Zugu right there. And, um, I guess before I do any more reviewing, I might as well put the iPad in. So let's go ahead and grab the iPad. Pretty easy to put in. Hold on, there's something on the case. Okay, so once you got it in, this flap obviously is going to be there. Pretty easy what you want to do, is you want to take the case, take this flap, there's obviously a little velcro thing right there, stick it, actually just stick it under the iPad, 
And as you can see, there's another Velcro thing right there. Just push that like that. And now your iPad's in there and it's not going to fall out at all. See? You can go like that and it won't fall out. So now that the case is in here, um, I can tell you what uh, how good it, the case fits. Um, it fits good, but not perfect. Um, thing you can see is obviously it doesn't uh, push down... Um, doesn't like rest on the case on the iPad, so uh, it's gonna some probably dust or something might get in there if you use this case for a long time that could cause a problem. Um, one thing I'm gonna say about this case that I absolutely hate, and it's not just about this case, it's what I hate about every case. So uh, most of you already know what I'm gonna say is this thing. I absolutely hate this. I wish they would sell models that had this and then didn't have this. I hate having the light sensor there because I don't even use it. I don't think it even works that well. But they have it, so uh, that's great if you like the light sensor. I absolutely hate that feature. It bugs the hell out of me. Um, down here, you've got a nice cutout for your uh, home button. And then um, on the bottom, you've got great cutouts for those. On the side, we've got nothing except for these. Your volume rocker and your uh, uh, rotation lock switch. And if you have 4.2, it becomes a silent switch which is kind of dumb. On the top, we've got obviously your headphone and microphone and then uh, your power on and off button. So uh, before on the regular, just the first case that they made, they had this logo blowing up all over the case. Right now it's in the bottom, it looks a lot more professional, it looks like you know they're not um, bragging that it's their case, it's just down there and you get a nice feel of the leather. On the back, we've also got Zugu again on this thing. What this thing is, the kickstand. We've also got this, which is the head spin now. What's what's nice about this is you can flip it around and you can put it like this. And now if you're going to be going somewhere and you are afraid of this part opening up, it's not going to open up. So now that will stay shut and your iPad, will, your iPad screen will not get damaged or anything. The only bad thing about having Velcro on a case is after you use it a lot, uh, not only is it just dirt and crap going to get on the velcro like carpet like just pieces of carpet um but uh it's going to wear down which is not uh good so um this case will eventually wear down which is not very good but most cases do end up wearing down so uh to put the headstand in its uh or to put to use the kickstand all you're going to want to do is take this actually I'm kind of doing this backwards let's try this again all you do do is take this and then uh, you want to put it at the angle you want. So let's just say right there. And now we've got a nice viewing angle. And there I am. Hi. Now we've got a nice viewing angle for uh, whatever you want to watch. YouTube videos, movies, something like that. As you can see, it's just a nice... It's actually pretty hard. And uh, it's very nice leather. This whole case has nice leather. Nice, nice, nice leather. All right. So uh, to put that back, it actually has Velcro right there. You can just stick it on. And this thing isn't going to go flopping around either. But uh, when it is in the case, you can access your home button every, uh, really good. The only thing that uh, I have a problem every now and then accessing is going down on the volume switch. But just because uh, this thing is up a little bit high, but uh, I, I get used to it after a while. I mean, because it's up higher, so it's ha sometimes harder to press it. It would be nice if they could move it down just a little bit. Not a huge deal. Not bugging me too much. But, uh, you know, it's, it might bug some people. But yeah, that's uh, pretty much it with this case. I don't think I missed anything. So like I said, it's just a great case, nice leather case. Uh, it does get lots of hair on it really easily, especially if you have animals. So you always have to be washing that off. But uh, yeah, it's a great case, guys. I do recommend go getting it for 50 bucks. It's kind of pricey, but um, it is good. It is a good case. And again, it's 49 bucks. They're only taken. So one dollar of that is going to help children around the world, and they don't even have to do that. So yeah, if you guys want to check out one of these cases, maybe buy one. Go ahead. Uh, go to Zugu.com. There's their address. It'll also be in the link below. You can just click that. It'll go straight to their website. Um, I'll try to find this guy's YouTube um, thing, and you can see, actually see his story about uh, he got fired from his job, and he made the, the first Zugu smart case. And he made the second one, and now he's doing great. Um, he's happy. And, uh, yeah. So, thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you, Zugu, for sending this out. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Please comment, please thumbs up, please favorite, and please subscribe for more reviews and uh, giveaways and everything. See you guys in my next video. Peace out.